video is sponsored by the design mechanism the makers of Mithras Mithras is a registered trademark of the design mechanism Inc used with permission all rights reserved yes I am Mr Pickles and I play Rabbit the fastest character in the city I hope at least within this group um she is able to basically do anything fast. That's the best way to put it. She reacts fast. She she runs fast. She heals fast. She gets so much luck that she's just lucking fast. Um, <laughs> she's impoverished mostly. So her downside is that she doesn't have a lot of money to spend on things, mostly because any money she does get, she ends up eating in a sense. Um, if she stops eating, then she gets some penalties. They'll eventually kill her much quicker than anybody else. She dies fast. Um she does have regeneration, which helps against some other things, but mostly she's sort of like the uh, crowd control of this group. She goes between enemies dealing quick hits to do a little bit of damage or trip them up, but otherwise she's not the big hitter. She's the crowd control. She has a lot of athletics and, and various like physical skills, but not a lot in the way of knowledge or science or things like that. She's a bit streetwise, but other than that, that is Rabbit. And with that, I will pass it on to her BFF. Played by Medivac. Oh, why? Thank you. That's best Ouch. best friend Ouch. ever. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's good to be on our own. <laughs> That's what it is. <laughs> um, unlike Rabbit, hi everybody. I'm Medivac, and I play uh, Misty or Sophia Samson. Uh, and unlike Rabbit, she has the money, and she has all the money. That um, does. She's a mid twenties lawyer. Uh, she has her own little firm, her own little um, floor in, 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 a, in a building as well with, with people working for her. And, and Rabbit does do odd jobs for her and, and, and finds out information that she needs to know. Um, she had an accident when she was out with her parents and um, she's trying to get to the bottom of that, which will hopefully come to light in, in, in future times. Um, but the car was driven off the road and in, in, the, um, in the river. And her parents died, but while she was there, I mean, she might have died, we don't know, but something um, imbued her with the power to control moisture um, so she can control things like water. She flies using the power of water to, to jet her around, as a sense. Um, <laughs> uh, she, she can use jets of water to stun people. If it's a thick jet, a thin jet will, will pierce armour. Um, she can also summon a, a, a golem, for want of a better word, a water elemental, uh, which again will defend her and um, and stun people that it, that it hits. Um, yeah, so by day you will see a six foot tall blonde in a power suit, and by night you'll see a six foot tall blonde in lycra. Um, <laughs> Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and with that, I shall pass on to Captain Kangaroo. Hey everyone, I'm Captain Kangaroo. I'm sorry um ahead of time. I went to a, a Shrek uh I'm sorry, a Shrek themed rave last night, so I'm a little green right now. Um <laughs> <What? laughs> uh, my is voice that, a little dead. Is yeah. that is that true? It it is true. I went to a Shrek themed <laughs> rave last night. I, I still got green in my beard. I can't get to get it out yet. Uh, at one point um, with Captain Kangaroo, did you not think that was true? <laughs> <laughs> uh, it was fun. It was fun. Um, tonight I'm playing Banner. He is the powerhouse of the group. He's there to smash things and, uh, you know, deliver pizzas on time. Um, he's really just the all out <laughs> guy you, you go to if you want a hole in a wall, well, even though the door is right next to that wall. Um but you know, you know, keep it simple, keep it nice. Uh, maintain my voice as much as possible. I'm gonna pass the microphone to our GM in Wells. Uh, it always amazes me your life. Uh, <laughs> I just, I just, uh, I got a new car, by the way, everyone. Ooh, very yeah, exciting. Honda Civic. Is it, is it electric? <laughs> Honda Civic. Yeah. <laughs> Honda <laughs> Civic. The, the scary thing is you paid 30 grand for it. Um, <laughs> no, it's not a Honda Civic and Civic, and it's not electric because I don't have oh. a PowerPoint near my flats. And I, I tried running an extension cable down there, but it wasn't very practical. But I was drive I had to drive somewhere to pick it up. And then on the way back, I'm on the motorway. And 
I think, oh, there's nothing behind me. I'll just overtake the car in front of me, crossed over the lane, and the car drives oh, me back into the flipping. You, you, <laughs> didn't, you didn't indicate, did you? Oh. It has lane assist in it. I'm sort of yeah. fighting with the steering wheel like this. Yeah. yeah my, 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 not my, my van did that when I was overtaking the cyclist. I almost took them out. Because yeah. really, to indicate it cancels the lane assist. Exactly. Well, I found the off button as well, which was oh, yeah. <laughs> very, good. very, very good. Now, uh, we're, we're going to have a quick, and I mean uh, a quick, a quick update because um, the character sheets have changed. And just so we know everything, uh, do click along if you want to roll anything, then that's fine. And um, first off, just by the word difficulty up at the top, um, left there's like little arrows this changes whether or not you're broadcasting the roles to everyone or you're going to whisper them to me okay you still see them but the rest of the players um would not see them yeah, that's uh, the wi-fi signal isn't it yeah yeah, yeah. um so apart from that all the tabs at the top allow you to jump to something you might notice that when you open your tabs, any of your skills, sorry, there's not the bit that used to say trained or anything like that, you know. So when you improved something, you had to type it in to change it, et cetera, et cetera. That's no longer there. What you do is that you change your final skill and it will automatically put it in the other um Bar. So say, for example, I've got a pistol of 68. If I go to improve it, you have an improve button now um, down below, which will automatically add on your intelligence and everything. So I can see there that I've now got plus three. So 68 plus three is 71. I just type it into that box and it will automatically change the other. So you can actually, uh, you don't need to add things on, you can just do it in your head. Does that, sorry, does that roll the actual dice as well automatically? Um, yeah, it, uh, that, Im that improve button does, it rolls the dice, Brilliant. it adds on your intelligence. Your yeah, and that's yeah. it. And so the now if you roll the attack, um, you can see that it's nice little colors now. You can see the critical for every level of difficulty. So if you're in the chat now, you can see my very easy, which is technically double my skill. My percentage is 136, and the critical there would be 14. So if I got less than 14, it would have um, it would have critted. Underneath there, you have hit location. Um, low, standard, and high. So this is built in now. So you can just roll standard and it will roll your hit location. If, for example, you can only see somebody's legs, then you will click the low and it will just lo um, roll the lower half of the body. If somebody's behind cover and you can only see the top half of them, then you can just click high and it will um, automatically um, roll it. You do have to choose a target, okay? If uh, if I choose a, a target and then uh, or I've got to have my target on, then it needs to know, it'll come up and say, which token are you hitting this with? Apart from that, there's nothing much that has changed on the actual character sheet apart from everything's linked together. Um, down the side now, if you click on the roll dice, it will give you like a table so it automatically can roll um, 4D4s or anything like that. If you want to see what it was like beforehand, if you click the advance button, then you get the advance roll, uh, et cetera, et cetera. And that's all there. On that dice roller as well, there's a switch at the top that you can switch over to roll it directly to me. You can see it, but nobody else will see it. Apart from that, everything's there. Notice the, snap, the little ruler. You now have the option down at the bottom to hide from others. Um, so if you're busy measuring things, you can 
hide it from others and we won't see it um, on, on the sheet um, at all. Apart from that, I don't think you have any more of the buttons that are around. So, um, but if anything doesn't work tonight, then we know that we just need to, um, I can report it to Digital Pagan, who is the guy who creates it um, all for us. And he's on the Mithras Discord. So, and he's, he does it free of charge, etc. So I think it's absolutely fantastic. Okay, before I give you a quick synopsis of the adventure up and where we're up to, I'd just like to give you some ways that you can support us. So you can support all the RPG um, content by going over to the Kofi site. You can follow that and you can also um, donate. You can actually support us for as little as one pound level of a membership there. And or you can help donate either via membership or money to donate us to our goal, which is to pay for the Zoom call. If you are a member, then there's a variety of benefits. You can actually provide a what I'm going to call a hero role now for your favorite player or character. What that allows you to do is that that role will automatically um, be successful and or uh, a role can automatically fail so you can use those hero points to um, save the life of your favorite character or play or you know save my life um you can also for green or above um have a sneaky peek at the character sheets the character sheets are all up there now so for um mithras i'm busy doing the others as we speak and um I put Ulrich up there as well. So players, if you are a green member, I, I know Medivac is. If you don't want to see it, don't look. Um, you can also gain access to the World Anvil site to see organizations, NPCs, and even past adventure notes for the right level. And of course, on Twitch, you can subscribe, give bits or donations to support us. And please remember that you don't need to support us with a monetary way. Uh, following the Twitch channel, hanging out in the chat and sharing the world are really important to us. So thank you very much. We really value your support and uh, appreciate it. So at the end of the last adventure, and I had to go back and listen to it while I was making my tea, uh, that supper or dinner, um, and listen to what had happened. Supper. What? So, <laughs> that sounded like some weird... <laughs> Exorcist <laughs> moment. Um, so the party have been hot on the heels of a group of in, a group of individuals called the Coven. They appear to be capturing or stealing relics from around Metro City from museums in order to create or open a portal between our world and the afterlife. Unfortunately, the Coven is not opening it up to heaven. It's going straight for the demon and hell version. The party have been running around trying to stop this from happening. Along the way, they saved people on a bridge after a huge car crash. And what you can see on the screen is um, some activities that they did. They stopped a group of gangers um, harassing an old lady with her four chihuahuas um, or miniature um, pincers, I think. Is that right? Anyway, something like pointers, maybe. Um, so they did that as well. Anyway, at the last adventure, they received a very cryptic note from somebody called Warlock. They journeyed to almost like a different plane, a different level of experience. When they met Warlock, who's a very flamboyant and very powerful individual who seemed to know each and every one of the three characters in some way. He also let them know that the Covenant is about to use the um, relics, they've got all four of them now, to open a portal to the afterworld, to hell itself. However, because they don't have the center circle, which Warlock has, what will happen is that the um, nasty demons, etc., 
will come straight through and ransack the whole of Metro City. So the party have been um, given the location of the summoning and told that it is now time for them to save the whole of Metro City. And there's no Network 7 update because this is a carry on from last time. So you have left Warlock's um, domain. And if you remember, you came out and you could no longer see the doorway or how to access it. Um, other things that you had asked about, um, Misty, you had asked Warlock about the darkness that you had experienced beforehand and asked if there was any way that you could overcome that. And Warlock was quite non-committal about that. Um, Bala, you commented about were you, were we were you all good enough to do this? And Warlock told you to look deep in your heart uh, for that courage and confidence to do a good job and get out there. And Rabbit, you said nothing. You just ate a lot of um, <laughs> um, bars of whatever while you were there. Okay, so. Yeah, I did. <laughs> say again, sir. I said, yeah, I did. Yeah. <laughs> So um, we're going to pick it up from when you actually leave the domain of Warlock. So you can, if you remember, you passed through what appeared to be an illusionary wall, but coming out of it again, you suddenly realize that that portal, that access point had been, has gone. Mm -hmm. um, the other thing to remember, sorry, is that remember tonight there's a huge... Um, gala, celebrity gala going on in Metro City at Town Hall and the majority of the police force are there um, protecting the celebrities and so just keep that in the back of your head. Oh, Warlock said that it's giving you the location you could either have a paper map or you could have it electronically sent to your communicators, your phones and it was in the sewers which is always a good place to start a summoning. Um, yeah, I'll hand it over to you guys. What would you like um, to do? Did we get a location in the sewers of where it exactly is? Um, where is it, it is. In the, yeah. Yeah. So is it what, just a general in the sewers? Yes. Yeah, so no. So what you've got is an access point, the closest mm -hmm. access point to the summoning, and then almost like a uh, sort of like a route map. Um, mm -hmm. how to get there so as long as you follow it once you're in the sewers you'll get there so it's not a case yeah i see what you mean it's not yeah. a case that you need to wander around the sewers whatever Brilliant. you've got a, yes. you've yeah. got a specific location yeah um i'm going to turn to banner and, and rabbit and say what what what's the betting it's below the gala what is a gala you know, <laughs> you saw it on Network Seven last time. <laughs> oh, the 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 fancy dance. Oh, of course, mm. yes. Um, right. hmm. I need to check yes. out Banner's intelligence because <laughs> I, I am so worried. <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> <laughs> it's a nine. <laughs> <laughs> it's average. Yeah. Oh. What, yeah, 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 yes, of course. Yeah, yeah, you're you're at least average banner. It's okay. <laughs> don't, don't don't worry about it. Don't think about it. No, because that'll hurt. Okay. Um well this is what I think. We should all we go in the sewers, um try not to swim, and uh we go there and just beat up some some uh, witches. So yeah. Makes sense to me. I couldn't agree more. Um, we need to get some lights. Mm, yes, of course. And that'll be a good idea. Lights. And we need to find some way of dealing with that darkness if they cast that on, you know, if that suddenly appears again. Mm, um... so maybe tie some bells around your feet. <laughs> <laughs> Jingle bells, banner smells. <laughs> Especially because he's in the sewer. <laughs> um, 
I'm still Maybe. baffled that there's such a thing as a Shrek rave. I just, I'm just, I just can't believe that. That where have I been my 56 years on this planet? I, really not I went, a Shrek rave. I went, yeah, I was, exactly. I, was, I, was, <laughs> I had a name tag. I had a name tag. I, I was I call myself Shrek Junior because uh, <laughs> I look like the offspring of Shrek and Fiona. So I have a. Was everybody <laughs> dressed up as Shrek then? No, everyone was dressed up as characters from the movie Shrek. No way. So, yeah, so, yeah. So which two, which two people went as donkey? Uh, I found a few donkeys. Uh, it turned out they just oh. didn't have pants on. Oh. Um, but <laughs> but uh, my my friends uh, went as like the fairy godmother. I had one friend who had a, a like a, a glow mask and he, he was wearing wear like a circle. He played the... Uh, Oh, the mirror, the mir- magic mirror. Oh, yeah. yes. Um, yeah, I had a few, a few, there was a few cool people. We, we had, had this one guy from top to bottom. He wasn't a giant, like he was in a, a skin tight like suit as the uh, as the gingerbread man. <laughs> like, like, like. <laughs> Are you sure this is? Just I couldn't see his you face. Like, yeah! it was literally. Like... <laughs> you have green on your hand still. How many hours ago was this? Uh, Did you like come right from the rave? <laughs> well, I woke up where i was and then i came here <laughs> okay so you woke up at the rave and then it went a little time to go roll some dice yeah i showered <laughs> once and that time i showered well, what was the, what was the king called is it farquad Far- farquad yeah. yeah lord farquad <laughs> See, there was also a few lord farquads some of them were sexier than others yeah <laughs> Maybe. There were sexy Lord Farquads. Uh, at least they had not, they had a, they had a good amount of cleavage. What? <laughs> I don't think Lord Farquad had any cleavage. I, I was. I just, don't remember that being part of the movie. I, I was trying to think that the only female characters I know in Shrek oh witches. Um, you know witches. You got the sisters. Yes, ugly sisters. Yeah. yeah. Um, you got the queen. Oh um, yes, Julie Andrews. Julie Andrews. Mm. Yeah. yeah. And, and uh, Fiona. The fairy Fiona. godmother. Oh, Fiona godmother, Jennifer Saunders. Yeah. Hold on. Maybe I can show you one picture. Uh, if I oh, it. no. The, the dragon. Yes. Yeah, sorry. Chatters has said the dragon. Yeah. Um, just to let you know, uh, <laughs> Medivac, when... Is it, you guys see this? Oh, hang on. Let, let me. It's very blurred out. Hold on. <laughs> I, 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 need, I need my thing. Um, you need to I take mean, your camera's oh. blurring it. I think. The oh, 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 no. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, pull it back. Oh, hello, ladies. How That's weird. That doesn't blurred. look like Shrek at all. It's <laughs> <laughs> um, right, like a rave. <laughs> Was it an orgy? <laughs> <laughs> Did you just Only get in the paint bathroom. and green? Only and in the bathroom. Only in the bathroom. Like rave? <laughs> Were, were I was the only one that was. I was the only one that that committed and painted himself green. I didn't see so anyone you're else. You're the only one who was actually making a Shrek rave. Yeah. <laughs> no, there was other people there. It's just no one was committed like me. I, yeah, I looked everybody like a was straight dressed normal. Orc. It's yeah. supposed to be like motion beautiful capture. orc. Like I'm green in motion capture. <laughs> <laughs> you can't see me. I have to say, uh, Misty, when you were doing your. Uh, character introduction zal in the chat said ja, zal in the chat said like a jet washer <laughs> I, I, i'm the female catcher <laughs> misty the jet washer <laughs> i'm going to use that i am going to use hero that. by hero by night uh, lawyer by day and car washer by weekend yeah. <laughs> five dollars five dollars wow five dollars cheap um yeah, so um so you think it might be actually underneath the gala and you um so you can get um electric torches um if you wish that shouldn't be a problem. Um Misty you've probably got enough allotment points to um give everybody a torch. Um yeah. if everybody wants one, it's up to you. Maybe there's Maybe some more, so we have to hold them. Or or on your head. Mm. Can you mm. see, like a little yeah. running, Headlamp. yeah, running light, because that would be um, yeah. easier, wouldn't it? Yeah, and, and maybe some glow sticks too. Um, that could be useful for a lot of things. Yeah, I'll get some glow sticks. Now I'll get different colored ones. 
yeah, now I can run really fast with the glow sticks and it'll look yeah. like a, a glowing <laughs> blur. So, and and you, can go, you can go to the rave. Well. <laughs> is this what the gala is? Is it secretly a rave? It's, a, it's like a rich person rave. Yeah, yeah. Slower music. The orgies are in the upper stairs. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> everyone's, everyone's wearing masks. Over the masks. Yeah, <laughs> Just, I, I it will fit right in. <laughs> I I'm not saying uh, a word. Uh, right, <laughs> um, token emits light. Just keep your eyes wide shut. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm not. I'm honestly. I am not entering into this conversation. <laughs> Because I just know that I'll say the wrong thing um, altogether. So, okay. Um, anything else you want to do or say before you head off? Can I? Can I do my one thing? I, can I? Um, I think at my place I wrote down that I have a shotgun. Can I grab that? <laughs> what? <laughs> What would Banner use a shotgun for? <laughs> Murder. I just need to. Oh, just... right. You can throw it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You can... <laughs> if you want to. <laughs> I'm like, here, this is too easy. Here, take my shotgun. <laughs> Shoot me. It's not in your combat um, style, I don't think. It is. No. <laughs> I have melee, thrown weapons, shotgun. Swear to God. I didn't touch it. It's right there. So, um, so <laughs> do you wish to take um, a shotgun with you? Yeah. Okay, then. Do you have the um, stats <laughs> for a shotgun? Well, what's that specifically? Uh, right, I, I'm going to um, pop it into your... Um, I mean your sheet. So just... Um, okay. I'm just typing it... Um, in for you 3d6 you can crush a man's head with your fist yeah and then i can also blow off his junk with no, my trigger finger i, 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 I like, think your I like fists are probably figure, stronger I like the original <laughs> figure, the he, he, based on the rules it's 2d10 or 3d6 3d6 right <laughs> uh, it looks badass and, and quite patriotic does it I, like i imagine a shotgun looks small in your giant hands with your giant muscles you probably but... make these guns look smaller than they are <laughs> like if you held a handgun it would probably look laughable like why do you have that little pea shooter i have now put your shotgun <laughs> on so it <laughs> fires um uh, 3d6 is is its damage um yes it, you have um, six shots in it before you need to reload, and your reload is three actions. This is very sexy. I cannot wait. I'm I can't blow some kneecaps. <laughs> I really can't. I mean, I I heard in the, the the story description of this campaign that we're not killing people; we're just like battering them and throwing them around. This is the this is definitely the final <laughs> shebang. I'm going to make it a bang. Cool. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> when our when, when our headlamps go go dark, I use the shotgun to light light the way. Nice. Oh, I'm gonna die. <laughs> I'm just loading up my people with um, sniper rifles. Ideally, nice. an Uzi too. They should. One of them should have an Uzi. Uh, machine machine pistol. Yeah, I could do machine yeah, pistol. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Full well, auto. What, what worries full... me is that. Uh, Rabbit's going to run ahead. And then there's going to be lots of scatter shot. <laughs> yeah. I'll try my best not to shoot Rabbit in the face. Um, you're... Okay, well, don't use face. choose location then. <laughs> <laughs> Left pinky. I will put on your... Um, I forgot to put the range... Uh, mod. Oh, hang on. That's why it won't fit because I've put it in the wrong one. I put mm -hmm. it in your melee and not your missile. Oh, of course, yeah. Um, well, I might, I might, might hit people with the bottom of it, but yeah. Um, force. 
Eight. If you fail a shotgun attack roll. Yeah. Do you just like snap your shotgun in half and exactly. rage? <laughs> exactly. Like, oh, dang it. I missed. Oh, dang it. <laughs> just, just Can I reload it back together? <laughs> I just break it on someone's forehead. Six and six. Load three. Um, um, armor points t -t 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 six, twelve. Right, I have popped in the right one now. Uh, let me just delete that one. Uh, delete done. Okay. Um, right. Yeah. So, what's going to be the um, plan, people? Banner's now um, got to his shotgun. The Roy the celebrity gala is going down well. There's um, the streets are virtually empty. Do we get people, our headlamps? People are either at home watching the gala or, you know, headed out of time. But thanks for your support. Um, Thank you, thy royal fleets, for your donation. That takes us one step closer to our Zoom. Thank you so much for that. Um, yes, so anything else you want to do before you head down the um, towards the sewer location? We'll take it one step at a time. You know, I think the quicker we get there, the quicker people are saved. Um, okay, yeah. So you... Oh, did you want glow sticks? Yes. Um. Yeah. Yes. You know. Yeah. Throw them into locations and, and light up areas from a distance. Are we gonna Are we gonna bring a Bluetooth speaker? Just kind of you know create the scenery or no? <laughs> well, my, my thing for the glow sticks is you can you, you can have um, uh, green and red, and you'll have red for bad, and green for good areas. So we'll go through the sewers. You can mark out. Oh. Perhaps. Why you, Why you scouting ahead of us? Misty's got a good intelligence. Coming up with the ideas. Yeah. Miss yeah. Deep Deep Intelligence. Oh, do you? Yeah, oh, yeah. oh, super intelligent. And do you have enough? She is a lawyer. Come on, guys. Yeah, that is. Do you have enough allotment points to grab? Um, you only need one um, for headlamps. I, I should have. Where's my allotment points? From Gear and Wealth. There we go. Um, My allotment points are on here. Whereabouts are they on the, on the page? Hmm. I imagine right. she'd, she'd be fine because, as I said, she, she's a lawyer. And a good one at that. Mm, maybe they haven't. Let me, let me scroll back at my page because I think we wrote them down at some point in here. I have mine under passion. Maybe you put it there. Under what? Passion. Passion. Yeah, there, I didn't see like a good oh, location. Oh, yes. It, yeah, allotment. Um, so your allotment is 50%. Yeah. <clears throat> Which means you have five allotment points. Oh, thanks, then. That's right. Yeah. So you're, you're the um, super... Oh! Oh no, where did it go? I've just found a way to get rid of the dice rolling bar. You can now get or move it out the way so you can't see it at all, which is cool. There's a little hamburger menu up at the top left of the bar at the end. Didn't realize you could do that. Um, okay then, so you've got head torches on and some glow sticks and a shotgun, a combat shotgun. Anything else that you would like to do? I feel like I'm missing something, but it's not springing to mind. Yeah, um, I've given you three three opportunities. <laughs> no. <laughs> make think sure that Rabbit's got plenty of food. Yeah. Um, For me. Um, got my I got my shield right. Yeah, you get shield. Uh, what can yeah. we do? Does it? Yeah, don't you summon your shield? Yeah. It, yeah. It, 
just make sure I got it though. I mean, and leaving the bathroom or something. Can you see nothing but blackness at the moment? Yes. Yeah. Cool. Oh. Well, yes. What can you see now? Me and blackness. Da, 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 da. Oh, oh, close it, close my eyes, close, close my eyes. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Okay. Uh, let me, you, oh, yes, you can't see anything, can't you? Uh, let me just check. <coughs> da, 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 da. Mm. Why, if I do that, oh, is that better? Who's to say? I, I, see I don't nothing. see a thing. Yeah, that's, I can see fine now. Um, yeah, hang on, let me okay. just, can you see the other? I can see Banner and Rabbit. I think and Banner's the currently has a blind on its face. As well. Ah, I see now. I see. Yeah. I see dead people. Like Can like we get things like flashbangs? Um, I see now. I see now. Um, yeah, you you can. Um, the The difficulty will be the um, if you remember they have like a restricted level, mm. um, which then will take you time. And unless you've got an organization to um, mm -hmm. support you with it, then it's going to be less than easy to get yeah, plus thing. yeah plus um you would throw it with just your basic skill yeah <laughs> which is well the whole thing there was getting rabbit to run it just to, into the middle of people and just let go and then come back oh i see i see what you mean so can if, we... if you've got these witches casting spells it'd be a great way to blind them it would be i see what you mean yeah blind them with your powerful light rather than darkness can you see that little doorway there that i'm pinging yes um so that doorway um you've come through that beyond that um can you see it's just like um, a little room i'm just putting mm -hmm. you in one one at a time so you can see it yeah and that just yeah. sort of like has a ladder that goes up and the um the direction shows it going i'm going to give you like north south east and west um this way um this is the way it sends you this way just seems to be a long long corridor or sewer tunnel that goes on and on and on um you can see exits coming off and on it you figured that you're in the main the main sewer that probably runs underneath um, Metro City. Um, from where you are, then giving that uh, idea of um, where you came down in the sewer, this way, if you can see that ping, that would lead you underneath the gala. And that's also the way your map goes it the map is almost like just a straight line with the tunnels on so it shows this chamber that you're in um etc etc i have the smarts i was right <laughs> so yeah so who who's going to be um leading the fray well i think it'd be only sensible to have rabbit go scout first Okay, yeah. Uh, and we'll follow at a leisurely slow pace. Okay, I'll yeah, just... Rabbit's friends. a little uncomfortable here, but she'll, she'll, uh, right. she'll is scout. This, is this whole thing a corridor, or are these little bits here? Um, are they just waters flowing? So through? the water is flowing around the floor. Um, gotcha. It looks like these are... Because of the multiple ways the water can go, there seems to it's not very deep at all. Um, plus, mm. um, 
you haven't had a lot of rain in Metro City um, for a while. So it looks like Very it's mysterious. quite um, low. Um, Rabbit, mm. from where you're stood, you can see another part of the architecture down here. Um, you can all see it. So here, there's a grill. Um, so like a series of bars that's going from the top of the tunnel to the bottom of the tunnel. Um, it looks like it's just something that if there was a flood or anything like that, it looks like they can be stopped. Um, Rabbit, you can see, well, Banner and Misty, you can see it as well. There is um, a way of opening it. Uh, hopefully this description makes sense. It's just like a bar across um mm -hmm. so you just sort of like turn it so it's vertical and then you can push it open does that make sense it's not mm -hmm. like a lock or anything it's literally just uh -uh, and then it would open inwards and rabbit you can see um if if i just move it down the water continues um down that sort of like um bit yeah um would you yeah it, you can shine your torch down there you can just see it seems to be a bit of a a corridor that or a tunnel that goes um off um so how far ahead do you want to go rabbit um not too far ahead this rabbit feels a little uncomfortable with these more closed in confined areas these tunnels um but yeah, her, her plan is to go ahead like maybe 50 feet, um, 50 to 100 feet, depending on how confident okay, she then. feels at a given moment. So, and then come right back and give updates to people and then move forward. Oh, yeah. Um, so um, you can actually get to here and you notice that this, it's not very well marked on the map, but th this, I'll just move you down a bit so it's in your, can you see this? That's a door. Um, similar to the one that you um, came through. Hmm. Well, that definitely seems like an important thing. Um, the map, and I, I yeah, the map tells you to go down this point. To go. If, south. if I find a door, though, I'm I'm going right back to my group. I don't know what could be lurking here. I need their their help. So I would go back and be like, okay, we got a door. We got a door that we can go through. That might be important. Now, why would they have a door under here unless it's for maintenance or somewhere important? So you want us to open it? Why didn't you open it? Uh, because I'd like to have all my comrades with me. I don't know that this there could be a coven person right behind this door, and if I'm going to go against them, I want you guys there too. Yep, yes, of course. Interesting thought process. Yes, I want to see you break their legs, Banner. Please, don't you want to break their legs? I also like like chicken wings. Just yeah, like chicken wings. Snap it. All right, ready for some smashing? Yes. Perfect. Well, she was through the door first. I was I was going to smash the door. No, no, we just don't. Oh. Okay. okay, so you can move yourselves through the um through the tunnel. And you, there it's, you go. That that circle there is that like a well, or is it? It's just like where the water congregates. But you do notice that there's a the um, rabbit is standing in it at the moment. Um, but it seems to be almost like a sinkhole. Mm -hmm. um, the water here seems to drop down, so you can see it coming in, and there's a little bit of a vortex and a, and a hole. It's not a massive hole. It seems to be going down to uh, another level. Um, this door has um, a similar turn to open, um, but it, it looks quite um, rusty, um, and it doesn't look like it's been opened for quite a while. Um, yeah. Um. I'm going to. This this isn't going to work. It's stupid. But I'm, I'm <laughs> going to try to create some mist just to put some moisture on the on, on the actual mechanism. You know the um the the, the bolt where it turns mm. in the hope of maybe uh, dulling the noise when mm. I ask Banner to open it. Got ya. Mm. Got ya. Um, it's a shame I can't create grease. Some WD water. Yeah. Water. yeah. 
So, yeah, you sort of, I imagine you probably, uh, what's that look like rather than me describing it? Well, exactly what you do there, I would put my hand over or, or very close to the bolt itself in the middle of the, the actual lever and just will the water or the moisture from my hands so it, so it penetrates the, um, the, the cracks that are in there because water does get everywhere. Water will find a way, as they say. Yeah, especially if so you don't use the check. restroom. Um, I know I, I'm more than um, happy. I don't think it's something that could go wrong necessarily, unless you do want to do it and we could use that Ooh. as your deafening role. So, yeah, why why don't you do that? And then... No problem. Do I, am I now just... Oh, that's just still there, isn't it? There we go. Yeah, nice. So, yeah, so you um, roll away and you... Currently, you sort of like I, rather than watering it, what I imagine that you've done is that you've almost like made a water globe mm. um, uh, around it. And it's just sort of like swir swirling around. So if there's any noise, it can the, be absorbed by uh, the water. Yeah. Good thinking. Yes. Um, mm. That's it. So, and Banner can literally, or um, Rabbit, um, can literally put their hands around the water. But because you're, You've got it there. You know, it doesn't lose its form. Um, Rabbit, you're closest to the door. Are you going to give it an open or not? Or are you going to let No, Miss... I, I want Banner to open it. Um, uh, so I'll give him the space to do so. Uh, I, I'm I'm kind of keeping, like, the, the back guard right now as got they you. go to investigate the door. I'm making sure none of those Banekins come sneak it up on us. Nice, yeah. Uh, right. Banner's going to use his large brawn to... Really open this okay. thoroughly. Are you just turning the handle? Or do you want to try to rip the the door? Um, off? I'll probably I'll probably grab the handle, but I will uh, pull it as as really okay. Very, so well, yeah, roll a, roll a bronze skill for me. All right. Do 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 do. Um. Um, do you wish to um, look it? Yeah, because that's embarrassing. <laughs> you can look uh, it. And... The, the one thing, I'll just, uh, reverse, is it, no, I can't reverse it. You can't reverse um, it, yeah. So I'm just going to, I'm going to do it again. Okay. See what happens. Yeah, it's a okay. lot better. Um, yeah, so you um, do manage to pull it round um but um because you failed the first one i'm just going to make the door is open but you go boom like that and you mm. suddenly realize that the latch um is now actually in your hand um so there's no way to reconnect uh, this door or lock this door now you sort of like got it in your hand, hand since the first roll failed and you have Ball in the china shop that if uh, a yeah. thing works so yeah so you've now got this um bolt it looks very rusty you don't think anything's been down here for some time um your um role um was a 25 i think it was um is that right misty uh, mine was yes 20. yeah um so i'm just going to roll it uh, my perception against your will. Okay, then. Um, yeah, so you can open the door now. I just pass the bolt. I just give it to Rabbit. <laughs> and uh, we'll continue. I'll hold Slowly. on to it. <laughs> okay, so is the, the idea that, Rabbit, you want to go down this tunnel until you find something different? Would that be a, a reasonable explanation? Um, I don't know. I'm feeling more and more cautious about this. I, 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 I'm up. Oh, shoot, I'm running ahead. Yep, I guess I am. Okay then. So, um, two things that you notice. I'll just put rabbit ahead, and Misty, you can come into the door. Um, you do notice that there's um, like a small ladder series of steps that takes you down to this new level. And if you look underneath your feet, you can see the water that swirled down before is coming out in, um, in a, at a lower level. It's as if there's a step down 
um, in the sewers. The other thing that you notice here, um, the water disappears at this point. Um, there seems to be like a uh, a door um, or like a, a metal service hatch and it seems to go underneath that and disappears. Um, rabbit moving down, you notice that later on it reappears. There's obviously some kind of side tunnel at this point that takes it off in a different direction, the purpose of which you are not sure um, at all. And then at this point, you can see that um, it opens up Rabbit um, into a, um, a square room. Um, with corridors going off in each direction. At this point, Rabbit, I would like you to make a um, perception check for me, please. Da, da, da. Okay, so to the... Can I use the point of luck? Yeah. I'll give that a little reverse then to make it a 35. As 35, goal. nice. Um, so down the east corridor... Um, you can hear the um, soft sound of chanting. Um, as you look down that corridor, you also notice that along the corridor, there are um, like lanterns or like, you know, like camp lights or something like that has been dotted around the corridor. So this corridor um, down here is actually um, available for you to um, look at and actually see um, the stuff um, going down that direction. Um, I'll wait till everybody else comes and then comes down and then I'll reveal it for you. Well, that's good because at the moment I'm hearing chanting and seeing these lights, I'm going to get a shocked look on my face, sprint back to my comrades, say, in, in as quiet as I can, I see, I see that there's lights down there and there's chanting. I think you're right. There's the people down there. We gotta go fast. We gotta go fast. We gotta have banner lead in and smash everything. Unless it's one of those what, hobo orgies. What we I don't think do it's is, that this time. Okay. What we need to do is once we can see the the light, turn our turn our torches off. Good plan. Oh, yes. Very, I can very see, yeah, that's why you're the intelligent one, Mr. Yes. <laughs> is, is, is it off? Is, is it off? I'm, I keep pressing my thing. Is it off yet? I, I, I can't is tell. Is it one of those that goes light, then bleeping light, and then bleep, 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 bleep light? <laughs> yeah, and you, you can <laughs> also have it flashing um, yeah. as well. Okay, so I'm going to turn the the dynamic lighting off because you can <clears throat> see down this um, tunnel now. Um, so you should be able to see down the tunnel, yeah? Yeah. Um, yeah. I'm going to make sure Banner's shield is out. Okay. Um, so several things that I would like to point out to you. So down here... Are we supposed yeah. to see the whole map or just the tunnel? Um, you can see the whole a whole no, map no, now. No. That's not a worry. Um, just to let you know, some of it's not accessible because I used a big map. For example, this bit in here, that's not really there. <laughs> so, and I all can't see it anyway. So, <laughs> um, so um, yeah. So you can see here. Can you see these? Mm -hmm. Those are iron grills that you saw before. Um, they're going from top to bottom of the sewer. Um, there's a trickle of water that is running down the side. Um, these, this door here and this door here, appear to be service hatches that actually allows you to navigate round the um, grills. Um, you can see through the grills and there's definitely light um here um you can't you can see shadows of things moving about and the sound is obviously going in that direction um but you can't see 
anything at all, if that makes sense. There's no, so it's, they're obviously out of sight what's happening. I kind of whisper to the, to the ladies, we need to hurry up. If they, if we take too long, they might finally finish what they're trying to do. Should we just rush them? Well, I think we should move faster. I think rushing may be giving ourselves away, but let, let's leave these doors open if it's for, if it's a service hatch, and then at least it's a fast escape if we need it. All right. Sounds like a good plan. But um, let's, let's speed up, but not be noisy. All right. Uh, we don't know what's in there anyway, so we can't go rushing through. I'll lead with my shield, ready to go. Okay. Um, what's the um, plan? So that's, um, are you going, are you planning on going round the grills or through the grills? <laughs> if we get oh. shotgun out or. Is, is this a, is this a door right here? Yeah. So that door is very similar to the one you saw up at the top. So it has um, a lever on that is mm -hmm. down in the locked um, position at the moment. The grill um, just underneath your to um, token, those are poles that are going top to bottom of yeah. the um, tunnel. Um, I think it would make more noise if I, you know, bend the grills. So I probably probably should go around and uh, go through the the door. Hopefully okay. that gets us to the other side. Yeah. Um, so give me um, a brawn roll for me. Oh, yeah. It's going down. Oh, yeah. Yeah, um, you grab this and you, you put all your strength in it and you're pretty strong. And you sort of like pull the door, the, um, the locking mechanism round. And as you pull it round, it lets out this sort of like um, um, sound as, as the door um, moves and opens. You do have access down that corridor now. However, however, mm -hmm. you do notice as the sound um, happens that um, you suddenly see um two of those dog like creatures that you um met in the the in the house if you remember the house the ones that came pouncing out at you um mm. you can see that they um come round the corner um sniffing and with their red eyes out um, they appear definitely to be some kind of a guard dog. Um, you've seen these before. Um, it's the one when, um, Rabbit, you jumped out the window. Yeah. Um, oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. So let's, um, let's pile on in um, to um, turn order. So if you'd like to click on your target and roll Do your initiative. initiative that would be absolutely brilliant where is it where is initiative here same place but you click on the the word initiative rather oh, than okay uh, okay okay yeah. Ooh, dang it rabbit this is my best role possible oh, yeah jesus if possible for now Ooh. Once my athletics goes up, that's gonna go up more. That's, uh, <laughs> probably do these three turns by the time I even wake up. <laughs> okay, let's move um that like so so rabbit. Um you are first up. Um the door in front of you is um open. Um uh, so this is turn round one, turn one. What would you like to do? Uh, well, banners in front of me, and and I... then there's the grill. Remember, there's his his tokens over the top of them at the moment. But can you see there's? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, 
uh, well, it's not a whole lot I can do other than draw my extendable quarter staff and get ready for him to slam through. Okay, um, then. So you saw like that. Uh, preparing uh, for combat. Um, yeah. Uh, on um, 23, um, the dogs move and they come up um, to here. They're sort of like. Um, Barking at you through the um, gates, through the grill, but there's no way they can get uh, through it. So they're just barking like anything. So, um, Misty, you're next. Yeah. Um, it's a shame it's a shadow run, then uh, probably could have gone twice before we went. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, what's my line of sight like to get the this one here? Um, they shoot through that way would it be are they too much in the way especially banner yeah how, Banner's, how, how big is the corridor um probably about a normal corridor size the, uh, i think the issue would be banner's quite beefy and he's got his shield out mm. and so i mean you could summon something or do something <laughs> with the water if you wish mm. Let's have a think. You're not going to get a blast past rabbit and no. banner. Okay. I'm trying to say my shields are too, my, my, yeah. are too just beefy. Big, it, yeah. Just, okay. My, so my muscles are in the way. Come on. What is this? I am going to raise up the water underneath them and hopefully try to keep them contained in one space would, would that be possible um, sort of create a cube of water over them is that is that a power to create large creations um yeah um so you can um create something here if you wish is that what you want to do uh, no, I, was, I, was, I was hoping to sort of, sort of like on one of the creatures uh, in order just um, to push them back. Exactly, away from the door. Uh, okay, then. So um, do you need to do a power roll to create that? Uh, Is it I'll like your willpower? I, I'll do a willpower check anyway. Um, let's have a look. Manifest large objects with power, spending two power points so you can create objects up to his power, and then I can then increase the size of that. Okay, so you can use up your two. You, I, you might not need a roll for it. Uh, yeah, I can spend four power points to make the objects up to double my power in size. Nice. Okay. So my power is uh, 16, wasn't it? I think. It is 16, so I can do uh, something 32 size. So yes, so I'll, I'll take four points off my power there. So do you want to sort of like make it all like this? Yeah. Or push them back even... If I can push them back into the other room, that'd be brilliant. Yeah, you can push them back um, mm -hmm. into that here. So tell tell me what happens. So as, as they're braying and, and, and snarling at the, at the grills, this water suddenly just comes up in like um, a, a, a plate, but as it expands outwards, pushing them back, it fills up behind itself. So it's like... Into a, more of a solid cube. Yeah, and so... It's, yeah, and it, so it's literally doing the whole corridor and pushing them back. Yeah. And so, they yeah. sort of like um, try to almost like swipe at it, but you just concentrate and it just slowly um, pushes um, them back into the room. Yeah. Um, nice. Um, Banner, you're up. Banner. Um, so this, this uh, door sorry. here, this door <clears throat> is open now this is uh, the door I'm, that you're he's, uh bear's gonna run through and try to get make it his way around the, the hallway okay then um so it probably way in your um movement what is your movement yeah. um it is i can think some moved around but uh where would my movement be now should be right below your initiative but yeah it's, it's, i've got oh, okay. to six uh yeah six yeah six uh, six so um 
So you can run for 12, can't you? Because it, it's double and then you could take a third <clears> of that. So you sort of like make your way round. You can get there, but you won't have enough movement to do an action at the other end, um, which means that you're round now. That's done and dusted. And we're going to mm. come up to um, turn two of the first round and rabbit. Um, my movement is 48. Um, so I'm hoping that I could follow Banner, but then like slide between his legs and move forward to try and attack one of these dogs. Is that, would I be able to make it there? There's a door in the way. Oh, the door right in front of him that he hasn't opened. That's. Yeah. You're saying that like, can, like, you, can you see that? I didn't have the yeah, option. Or for some reason, I thought he opened it there. I know you didn't say that. So I'm just going to go right behind him and I'm going to like poke him in the back with my staff. <laughs> and you're like, why are you moving so slow? Why are you the slowest person ever? <laughs> Banner, come on. We got to go beat them. Don't Instead you want to the break dog them? smasher because I would have put these dogs down. Oh my gosh. You're <laughs> like a cow with no legs. You're just ground beef. <laughs> Um, and that's my turn. <laughs> you try to say I'm beefy rabbit. No, I'm just saying cheap me. <laughs> Don't know. I just want you to go fast. <laughs> okay. Um at this point, um I'm just rolling um some more um initiative because the next lot will um be be able to uh move. Um, come into play. Uh, so they're going there. And I've got this one to roll. Uh, do, do, do. Oh, 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 oh. And then we've got this one to roll and this is the scary one okay let me just put all these um into water into order sorry so the um dogs are back up um they're backing up away from the actual um water um they seem to be yapping and they've also separated themselves out so they're um covering um the doorway um um misty can you make for me please uh, a perception roll um it can be easy you, it's just to see what if you can see anything through the water but it's your water so i'm going to allow you to do um easy peasy yeah nice so what you notice is that coming through the corridor um are two of the little um imps Some things, yeah okay but that's not the only thing you see uh because behind <clears throat> them comes what appears to be um a woman She's um, dressed in um, a long robe, um, head to toe. Um, she's got her cowl up as, as well. And she just comes to stand in the um, corridor um, there. Um, yeah. And so that's my roles um, done. Um, so you. Sophia, you, Mister, you get um, your action now. If if there's anything that you want to do, is this? Um, is, no, I'm. I'm going to. Uh, is it concentration? Sorry. Your or not? Um, it, it it will be. I would have thought to keep it there. Hmm. Um, it doesn't say. I don't think in the thing. It's just but it a, seems, a single cast. Yeah, it seems. Um, so so what I'll be doing is literally just staying there at the moment, waiting for Balance to open the door. Once she opens the door, I'm going to flood the area in front and let, let the water go forward yeah nice yeah okay then. Banner can get out. um so um banner yeah so banner needs to concentrate because remember it's a lefty lucy and ready tidy yeah just make sure you can really really and rabbits up. rabbits poking you from behind um as well just only distracting me rabbit yeah i don't know where you 
Okay, born well, please. Quicker, quicker. Yes, hi as well. Dead on the money. You so sort of like um open it and you are you going to just pull the door um towards you and then get it open as well as unlocking it? It's probably this. Yes. Yeah. And as that door opens, Misty, you see it and you release your um concentration, or you might even go and push your hands forward. So rather yeah, than that's the exactly what I wanted, that, yeah. that's exactly what I wanted to, to push to, to make everything go forward to create the space for him to come out. Uh, nice. Um, so mm -hmm. as it comes into here, um, I'm just going to make some um, evade rolls just to make, to keep things on their feet as the water comes through. So this is one of the hounds. Um, yeah, he's fine. Uh, the second hound, he's five. Um, Bainkins are going to have to make this as a hard, okay, because they're only little. You might think, oh, they should be um, formidable, but they can also fly as well. So they're trying to get out the way, but they are um, small. Oh, my. Oh, sorry. Wrong roll. Um, wrong character sheet there. Um, uh, 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 where's my Bainkins? Let me just um, open on the wrong layer. Let me just roll their, um, their evade. Okay, so here's one of them. That fails. Here's the other one. That fails um, as well. And then finally, I've got the um, underling. Um, they will roll as and they fail so what actually happens here the door the dogs stay where they are that's not a prop problem this person and the two banelings um get swept back slightly but they're currently prone now uh, on the floor does that sound roughly what you would have wanted to happen Indeed. Misty, yes. yeah, yeah, indeed. Sorry, okay, then. I've got to mute myself. Um, so, so that's um, all done. So, um, fine. Does um, anybody have actions for the last round? Rabbit, um, I, I've I should done have two action actions there. so far. Yeah, yeah. I've only um, done two actions, but I'm still stuck behind Banner. Um, the door's no longer there, so you can move through him um, if you wish. He's a friendly target. Oh, okay, yeah. Then I'm gonna I'm gonna roll right through, and I would like to go if I can with my forty eight, rush down over here and send a smack on this dog. Yeah, cool. Um, actually, I would like to use a power here. I would like to Ooh. use my um. Oh shoot, where did it go? All my boosts. Um uh here it is i believe my speed charge attack nice um that just makes it hard for them to uh resist my attack here yeah so you're um, taking two points of damage two power points aren't you? yeah yeah yes just hitting the one yeah um yeah because i don't think i can hit anything else with my speed charge here even if i spent more points got yeah okay, like then. it's it's i think we've judged it's usually in a line so yeah i'd, I'd have to stretch true, quite true. A bit to do that, yeah but... Okay, then um, whack, whack the war walk. The war 79 wog. out of 87. Wog, 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 wog. Um, yeah, yeah um, that that's a hit. That's a hit. So I need um, special hit location of damage. I've got no action points. Uh, special, I would like to have be a uh, trip if I can. Um, yeah. Can you trip a four legged creature? Um, yeah, you can. And I'll tell you what. Um, quadruple or many-legged opponents may substitute athletics for evade and treat the role as one difficulty grade easier. Mm. So if um, we'll match um, opposed role from your um, attack role to my either brawn, evade, athletics or acrobatics, and if it I'm rolling at an easy difficulty because I've got four legs. So is that what you would like to do? Um, I think actually I'd like to do a stun. A stun Ooh. special. 
with um, my, uh, let's do a 20, why is it all capitalized? Okay, um, right in the 12. Um, nice, that is in one of my front legs, yeah. Oh, excellent. Um, so stun your front leg and here is my damage. You need to overcome my armor uh, first. So seven damage is enough to go over my armor. Um, so that'd be five left. Okay. And then I think... Um, Endurance? It is, yeah, it is endurance. Thank you. Versus my seventy nine. Um, I get a a seventy five, which is not enough <laughs> to um withstand. So um, oh no, hang on, it's easy, isn't it? That was for the trip. This is the stun. Oh, yeah. oh yes, yeah. Sorry, yeah, got you. Yeah. Um, so it's. Uh, one of my legs, so therefore, um, his leg is sort of like incapacitated for equal to your oh. damage inflicted, so that's five. So you sort of like whack it it's on its leg and stuns it, and it, its poor leg is um stunned and it sort of like flops down um on, onto the um floor, so it's not out. It's just got a, a, a stunned leg, um, dead at, leg at the moment. Um, so, um, Misty, you are next. Indeed. So I'm just messing my touch sheet because it's missing things. Um, right. So I I would like to summon, which I can't because it's not my character sheet. Um, my simulacrum and oh yeah i'd like to put it sort of i can see down here so around about here oh sorry i don't oh, know oh no that's like a cigar <laughs> where did you want can, do you have yeah just literally to come out of the water that's perfect yeah just that yeah yeah okay brilliant and that would take PowerPoints, I assume? Um, yeah, but I can't remember how much <coughs> because it's not a machine. Oh. No, it's, it's disappeared. Has it dis it's disappeared? It's never disappeared. It's it it never word, happened. Um, sim what's it? It's called Summon. In fact, here we go. Summon. Right. Ba -ba -ba. You you busy um looking you busy looking it up, um and we'll we'll move um uh, ahead banner. Oh, actually, it's a concentration ball. Oh yes, that's a willpower, isn't it? Uh, yeah, I'll do that now for you. Why do you need a concentration ball? Um, to summon it, isn't it? But, oh, uh, details car power who can. Make one construct at a time, attempt to do the. Yeah, maybe not. No, you continue, I'll read. Yeah, okay. Right. Um, Banner, go for it. All right, Banner's going to run through. Um, <laughs> kind of limited on where he can go. Uh, he's going to go right here. At, as, can you he could, pull out you his. Could, you could run through. The, is this water, Banner? Is it, is this, <laughs> it's, just, just, it's just water, so. Yeah. I'm gonna run like through and, and, and <laughs> smash down on this guy right here, uh, this one right here. Okay. So run and yeah, attack. Yeah, that uh, that's cool. And remember, all this happens in five seconds. So you start running through, and as you run run through, this water to tornado uh, appears. Um, yeah, um, go for it, Banner. Um, smash Lacken. Let's do it. Smash away. Oh, yeah. Oh, crit on my yeah. poor little doggy. Nice. So you'll have two specials. And then. And um, you know what those specials are going to be max the, damage to the face. Okay, then. A max damage to the face. Um, yep. So 
Um, you bring it down on the poor defenseless doggy. <laughs> um, so what's what's your max? Is this with your shield? Yeah, so it's going to be uh, 20. 20 um, damage to the face. 20 because it's? 2d10. Oh, right, 2d10, but don't you have a damage oh, okay. modifier? Oh, so, sorry, it's 1d10 plus in the damage modifier is, is 1d10. So that the roll for the damage modifier? Yeah, that's so it's okay. 10 on the first one and then plus whatever your damage modifier I'll just I'll, I'll, I'll roll a, a 1d10 for the damage yeah, modifier. that sounds absolutely fine. All right, so 14 14 damage. points of damage on its head. Um, yeah. yeah, you you bring it um, down quite nicely um, onto his um, head um, that takes um, it out. And just, just before we go for our break, I just would like to say one other thing. You notice that there appears to be Rabbit and Banner. You can see this um, as well, Misty. From the water in the middle, almost like black tendrils and tentacles have started to weave its way <clears throat> up um, out, out of the water. And we'll... So we're about to start. Is that where they are there? Exactly, yeah. Oh. Uh, from from uh, there. So we are going to go and take our break now. Um, so we should be back about 10 to the hour. Um, go and stretch, stretch your legs. And when we get back, we'll see how the party do with these rising um, odds. Did you find out anything about your summoning thing? No, it, it doesn't say anything about cost and power. It says you can summon one uh, simulacrum. Uh, right. using your core power right i i'll have a look and see mm. but that's fine i think it should be quite natural but we'll see okay people we're going to go off oh. and... <clears throat> no, sorry, yeah sorry, we're going to yeah. go off and have a quick break and yeah we'll see you back here um straight after so don't go too far away we are going back live so watch your p's and q's Okay, um, so we've sorted out the... Uh, you have control over your um, whirlwind, don't you? Yeah. Yeah. And do I need to put it on the tracking or not? I can do. Oh, oh, up to you. It's going to go on my turn, so... I'm going to pop it up there just so I remember. Because of what, if it's there, then as we go through... I can um, make sure what does he have a name? No, it, it, no, it's just creation. If I should name every single one, I've got names. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> no, it's called a water one, water yeah, two. Water two. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. So yes, at the end of the last session, um, I mentioned then coming out of this part here. Um, are tendrils of blackness um at that initially point. that 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 was creating a shape i was like oh i don't know about that no it's it's uh, it's not make it says there and we come straight up to the top of the round rabbit um with you your dog is on the floor um it's proned it can still bite you it still has a bite function um, you can hit it again if you wish. It can't rise, though, so when it tries to hit you, um, anything that you want to do will be easy and anything that he wants to do will be hard. Um, I definitely want to hit him, and my goal here is to try and use Bash to knock him into the water towards the tendrils. Oh, nice. I guess. Yeah. Um, but here is my roll before we get ahead of ourselves. Fast and Furious. Uh... Four two of 87. Yeah, um, so so that hits. Um, he can't evade um, at all because he's got a, a leg out of action. Um, but yeah, what? You, so you'll get a special, and then uh, hit location and damage. Um, well, I was being honest. I do want to do a bash, and here is my four. 
Um, so that's in uh, another leg, one of its hind legs. So you probably take your staff and whack it down one side between the um, him and the wall and whack it. Yeah, do some damage for me. Please don't do minimum damage, please. Oh, okay. Um, six. Okay, then. Um, Was it one meter per... For every three points, yeah. Okay. Um, so how that. many... How many points of damage do you do? Um, six. Six, but after armor, I'm guessing. Um, yeah, four. a little bit less. Um, six, um, four. So yeah. Um, so he gets um bumped like a meter. So we'll we'll put him in. Uh, I'm all for this heroic um thing. <laughs> but what you notice is that these tendrils. Um, as soon as the the dog falls into it, they seem to wrap um around him and sort of like almost like hold him um in the actual um uh, water. Um, it doesn't look like they're doing um any major damage to him, but they are entangling him and making him stay in this one place um wargs attack now there i'm going to forfeit my next one as it gets wrapped around um and the next ones up are the bane kings um i'm just going to take ban i'm going to take that dog in front of you off i'm just going to move mm. out the way it's still there um, so in comes the banelings um, flying, but before that happens, Misty, you're a little bit you, Misty. You can't see through your creation, can you? As in, it doesn't give you sight. No, no, no got you. So banner and rabbit, I would like you to make a perception check. Uh, it's going to be hard because of the combat and everything. I just want to see whether or not you notice something. I would like to use a point of luck to re-roll this. Okay. Bring me down to four. <laughs> I love it when Mr. Pickle says, just to let you know, everybody, I'm down to four, which is probably more luck than any of you actually ah. start with. <laughs> <laughs> I got a luck fast. Um, um, yeah, we're just we're just focused on the, the attacks at hand, it looks like. Yeah. Um, yeah. Okay then. So, so that's absolutely fine. Um, in comes my um, banelings. Uh, da, 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 or, uh, there it is. Excellent. Uh, so these uh, attacks are um, um, coming in. They have that thing called tiny devilish strike. Um, so um, banner. This one um, comes um, to. Um, it comes into you, yeah, and he sort of like Gross. comes in and tries to um, hit you. What would you like to do? Mm, should I even try to attempt this wide away? There's no way it's going to hurt me. I think I'm, I'm more focused on uh, the chicken front, the chicken front of me. But but do you want to be glomped on? That was their main threat last oh, time. That's so right. They're that's... just going to drag you down. Yeah, I'll uh, I'll try to parry it. You can power it with your um, shield, yeah. Yeah. Um, this your combat roll, although it is. Um, yeah. So you uh, manage to. Uh, it comes towards you. You manage to swipe um, at it, which makes it backpedal, and it's sort of like flying um, above you at the moment. And then this one's um, coming at you. Um, rabbit. Uh, bring it. I'm gonna parry no matter what. Uh, yeah, it sort of like it comes down to you, but as you just shove the the dog out the way, it seems the dog moving and it back pedals, um, its wings. So they're both flying, um, uh, above you, and yeah, uh, she does that. Um, yeah, okay then. So we're left with now, um, Misty, you're up. Either you, you got your action, then you have your tornado's action. Yeah, um, sorry, bear with me. So 28, 
Dex is 11, so it's 20. I thought you were 28. That's no, your I'm, damage. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm just working out my hit because um, I can't put it on the actual Waterstone as character sheet because it won't let me because there's only three skills that have values of Elder Rust Zero. Got so I put a little I put a little thing on my character sheet just to see, excuse me, just what? to use. Yeah. And I just want to make sure that the figure was 50 was right. That and is it's cool. twice my twice yep. his strength index. Fantastic. Right. So as I'm staying at this, um, I'm going to command my water elemental to hit the thing in front of it first. So the, this one here. The dog, yeah. Yeah. Um, which he will do. With a well, hit me do, with but... your water tornado, hit me, hit me, yeah. Um, 50 percent um, of 35 that hits. Um, fantastic. I can't act, so you'll have Kelly has specials. Um, he's, he does stun all the time. Oh, right, got you, yeah, as in stun location, yeah, 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 nice. Um, uh, so do a... some damage. Sorry, I'm um, hang on, um, use your um high location at the bottom high yeah right yeah because it its legs oh. are quite um uh, uh that i will re re put, uh choose target click on the token on the screen to choose your target there you go so can you see if you do you want to do if you press high and right. then click on the dog yeah i, I did do that it came that message oh do that again. Oh, right. Well, I, I'll. I wonder why it does it for me, uh, and not you. Anyway, um, Ooh. are you happy for with the front legs? Oh, well, you can roll a one d twenty. Well, no, front legs are fine. Front um, legs are fine. Does it do, does it do damage as well? Um, da, da, da. it's probably the stun location on it. Um, to make sure, so that's one of its legs. Is that is that the same leg as you hit? Oh, I'm on the wrong sheet. That's why, uh, Mister. I believe I hit the left leg. Yeah, left and that, this is hitting the um, right leg. So how much? I I need you to do some damage. There we go. You got six points of damage. Uh, brilliant. So that would be six turns. This, this dog is, go, I'm going to cross it. It's going to be stunned to high heaven in it's there. It's got both legs stunned. It's got face is going to be in the water. Yeah, it's, it's face is drown. down and the tendrils yeah. are wreathing around it. Um, um, yeah. Um, and with my last action, I'm going to move one, two, three, four, five, and six. Nice. Um, banner, and hopefully it's going to keep a time right. next turn. Um, hopefully, let's see if maybe I can do this. Is it possible for me to leap to right here for an attack? You can't leap down the corridor because it's not high enough at the moment. Okay, you, you can go past the banking. The banking will have an attack at you as you go past it, a bit like an attack of opportunity, but. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm cool with the, the attack of opportunity. Okay. Um, so I, so... I feel like I need to. Well, with that, or is there is is the tra is the trajectory? Um, either way, I'm gonna get hit if I do this. So yeah, I'm just gonna run and try to get get in her way. Okay then. Um, so you show me where you want to. Um, Essentially, I'm up. just gonna right here. Uh, cool. So just roll your. Um, move your character to there, and then we'll do a little bit of um actions here. And da, da, da. so the the first the first thing up is the banking that makes uh, a quick random um a t swipe at you, um which <laughs> is um misses um altogether. Uh, however. Um, there's something else that happens that you weren't um, prepared for at all. Um, as you go through round the outside, you sort of like dodge out of the way of the banking and you're laughing at yourself as you're piling down onto this um, 
this hooded figure when all of a sudden uh, a black tendril, a tentacle shoots out of the water and it hits you on your 12. Oh, where is my 12? Hits my... Oh, darn it. Pop up. There we go. Uh, my 12 is my chest. Chest, so it um, shoots out. It, it's probably, you don't see it not coming towards you. You're probably out and it comes around and it wraps around your chest and it pulls um, you um, back um, slightly. Um, so just to let you know that um, all um, roles for you are now one grade higher, harder, okay? Mm -hmm. You can, if you wish, on your next turn, uh, make a brawn roll to try to um, pull out of it. Um, or can I, like, try to detach the tentacle? Um, yeah, so that's what, pulling out. So that's what the um, the brawn roll will be to sort of like, okay. oh, do you mean pull it out the water? No, um, I mean, like, essentially use my shield to slice off the tentacle. Okay, so you can use um, a weapon on it, but you would have to have a special effect, then use um, either your a damage to take off or disarm opponent or slip free. I, any of those specials will take it out. So, so um, oh, just make uh, an easy perception check. I'm not very perceptive, but I am today. Okay, yeah. <laughs> so as you got closer to this um, person stood in the middle, you notice that she has black eyes. Ooh, um, yeah, there's well. no white or anything. And you also notice her eyes are black. And you notice in the figure there's sort of like blue lightning. That's sort of like black um, mist or tendrils going around um, her fingers, and you get pulled back um, slightly, right? We're going up to the top, um, turn two, uh, Rabbit. Um, I would like to try and use my speed charge to hit the Bane Ken in front of me, and then... Oh, no. My my sec... <laughs> Close. <laughs> Close. I'd like my second attack, perhaps, to hit the tendril that's grasped onto him. Okay, could, then, yeah. Could that be an... Uh, okay. Yeah. Um, so that'll cost me one more for a total of three points here. Um, and this is my attack, then, to the Bane Ken. Okay, yeah. 32. Uh, um, that is uh, a hit, but um, I can try to um, e evade that. Yes, it is hard though. Remember, um, because of speed charge. Yeah, uh, which speed means charge. I actually that speed charge means I couldn't evade you because it my seventy uh, would have it would have to be forty nine or below. So um, I failed that. So you need a hit location uh, and damage on me. Um. And so it's I can just roll. hit one of these buttons in the combat, the low standard or high for hit location. Yeah, so I, we'll see whether or not it works. So hit standard and then okay. click standard. Then it asks you to choose a target. Did you click on the banking? Yes, like the dead center of it. And was the... Uh, um, Just roll okay. it. Wait, I clicked my own. I clicked my token. Now I'm going to click standard. Choose a target. Click a token on the screen. Yeah, okay, that, that's, that's all right. I, I can. Um, so it's working. I'll report it back to. Um, to watch me call it to um, digital pagan. So when I do it, I click standard. It says choose your target. So I click the banking. Uh, mm. And that comes up. That's fancy. Um, yeah, so it, it, it just sort of like means it's, but obviously it's not working um, for you at the moment. It, look, it looks is like, it, yeah, go for it. Is it a permissions thing? Maybe we don't have permission to. 
Yeah, but it, I think it must be something in the actual character um, sh sheet. Um, mm. Um, I'm I'm unable to like highlight the token. So when I I click on it normally, like I can't highlight it the same way I can highlight my character yeah, token. That, that, yeah, that's exactly what I mean. Yeah, that that's what I'm um wondering. And the the only re the only way I can um that's it, why it's like giving us all permission to move them basically. Um, Which, yeah. yeah, and so I actually have that clicked. I have that banking clicked now and yeah. selected, but I don't think that makes um, any difference to the can, the role. Can I just try something very yeah. briefly with, with my thing? I'm just going to do a roll, which will be a hit. I'm going to do a standard, Yeah, and then I'm going to click my token. There you go. What's tornado? Oh, that's good. So, what did you oh. what did you do? Tell me again. I, exactly the same as what I did last time, but because I can control my water tornado. Oh, that's I, why. I see because because you can use it. You've got permission yep. um, to actually. Uh, yep. So, most most all the other tokens that you control are literally just just part of the scenery. Yeah, got oh, yeah. So I I will. Um, see, it says um, determined, controlled by, and then it says determined by character setting um, on the actual. Right, I, I will look into that. Um, so really and truly, you need to be able to click on whatever, don't you? Yeah. So um, six. Um, yeah, that's one of my little spindly legs. Yeah, I meant to say stun target and then roll. Oh yes, but, um, yeah, yeah. My my fingers hit the buttons. So, um, yeah, I believe you get an endurance. But here's my damage before we get to that. Um, staff, a three. Um, right. So, um, yeah. Okay, then. So that hits my little leg. Do I? Did you say I make an endurance? Yeah, against your roll, which was a thirty-two. Thirty-two. Um, so that fails, um, and you hit its little leg, which is now uh, um, stunned. But since it's flying. Yeah, it's just dangling. <laughs> it's just sort of like dangling uh, around. It's not making a, a huge. Oh, it's all about the effort. It's all about yes. the effort. Um, wargs are out. Wait, 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 wait. I, yeah. I have my speed charge, though. I'm going for my second target. Oh, now. yes. Yeah. Like, I was just trying to do like disable that guy so i could get past and go to hit the, oh, the tendril I see it's grasped onto to banner here yeah so this is my it. next attack um and i guess if you need to try and evade with your wiggliness it is still hard 67 of 87 um that will hit my um my darkness um so hang on uh Okay, so you um, you will get a special. Okay, so you will have to use um, damage weapon. Does that make sense? Yeah, because I'm trying to break through it. Yeah. Okay, then. So that's your special damage um, weapon. Um, so off you go. Um, there's no hit location, so just roll your damage. Okay, I was gonna say I want to hit him in the tendril if I have to choose location. Yeah, maybe. yeah, yeah. You um, definitely hit Banner in his tendril. Four. Uh, uh, four, four points of damage. Yeah, you you whack this and you actually almost like slice through the darkness and the darkness dissolves um, slightly. And Banner, you there was a bit of tension there, and you you notice that it, you've been freed from the tendril by um rabbit um cool. bankins time um yeah are you all done rabbit sorry uh yeah yeah uh, i just had two attacks e yeah um okay then so this bankin had the one behind you has evaded once but it still has uh, another action so it will take um, a swipe at you 
Um, I'm going to just inflict damage um, on you uh, unless you want to argue that you can see this coming. Um, Are you going to argue it? But it misses in any case. So, so, <laughs> and just as you're laughing, this of one comes and attacks you from behind um, as well. So that <laughs> that will <laughs> yeah, yeah, <I'm> <laughs> that that will um, hit. And... Actually, I, let's just do it. I'm gonna roll. I run the two like roll and reverse that. <laughs> um, yeah, sixty one. Yeah, um, so that, that would actually um, miss there. Yeah, take your luck <laughs> roll um, um, off there. Um, yeah, um, Underlin is doing something special. And uh, Misty, you're up. I presume you're w mm. moving first. I do have to indeed, yes. So one, two, three, four. I declare a thumb war. I declare uh, a thumb, yeah. Five. Five, six, seven, eight. Let's get some... Popsicle yeah. sticks? Oh, make it attack the Bankins. <laughs> no, it's going to hit the thing in the middle with the tentacles. Yeah. Oh, hit, you should drown hit it. The, mm. the tentacles. Uh, yeah, yes. go for it. Um, did you say, did, did I hear there was something big under there? Um, or was it literally just tentacles? It's That's just. I was waiting for that. I thought somebody <laughs> is going to say something. The ten tendrils are coming up out of the water. Uh, right. There's nothing. You you can't see anything. There's a floating dog in there as well. Right. Well, in, in which case, <laughs> yeah. In which case, I will get it to hit the bank in there then. Okay then. Yeah. Go for it. Um, right. So wait, where did I put it? I put it. Hit me. Yeah. Oh, really it's coming. Oh, it's coming, definitely. Um, yeah. Um, so very nice. You'll actually probably hit it with that easy because it's I'm unaware of the attack. Mm. Um, so you'll have um a crit on him uh, as well if you could do crits. Oh no, you can't do specials, can't you? No, uh, just stun yeah. location and that's stun it, yeah. location, stun me. Um Hit location Standard. first. Let's see if this works. Let's do hit location. Let's do D20. D20, yeah. Ouch. Oh, Ooh, oh it's a left arm. That's a wing, hopefully. Um, bu, 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 bu. No, 18 um, is its um, head. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Well, it's, here we go, then. It's left. Prepared to be put to sleep. It's left wing. It has a left wing and a right wing. And then, yeah, do some damage to me. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> but but that, that, that is a stun, so he's stunned for one round. Uh, I think you have to overcome armor. Oh, do I? Oh, and it, oh it, they have one point of armor on the that, That's so oh, bless him. I, I'm, I'm going to look at the elemental and just <laughs> shake my head. <laughs> nice. Uh, um, Pala, you're up. All right. Um, I am going to, now that I'm free, I'm going to try to smash this woman as hard as I can. Yeah, go, go for it. Let's see what I can do. Hopefully. Damn it, I knew that. I saw that coming. I saw that coming. Um, yeah, um, just one a second um, before you do anything. Mm. Just need to make a... Do you, do you want to look it? Me? Do I want... No, no. Do I want does, to does, it? does Banner want to look it? Because uh, you can use one of the group ones. Yeah. It's there for a special... Super oh well, no, if he uses of... uses one of you've got those are hero points now. So oh, sorry, yes, that's right. We're talking, yeah, yeah. So he could use one, but it would mean that it would automatically hit no matter what. Mm. Are oh, you yeah. using one? But, yeah. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Are you going to use one or not? Bobby. I don't know. I don't know. Uh... Fe female, female. Yeah. Hold on a second. Oh no. Hmm. 
All right, sorry. Um, I'm not used to hearing female voices when I'm playing, by the way. Can I just... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, um, yeah, so what you um, do you wish to... What What did you get? 90... Uh, yeah, 97. So you can use a point of luck to reverse it to get 79. I'll do that. I use that point of luck to reverse it. Yeah. Okay, then. Um, so I need to... So what's it going to be? 70... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on. I, I, hit, I went twice. I actually pressed twice. I actually got a critical look. Oh, you did? Oh, yeah. Above it. My bad. Yes. I just... My, my, my mouse clicker. But it worked out. It Sorry, ma- I got a critical. <laughs> this, isn't, a this isn't fifth edition, you know, when you get advantage <laughs> and disadvantage. <laughs> no, you're, 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 you're right. Uh, well, okay. Well spotted. I was, I was like, why is it look? Why is this star right there? I was like, oh, um, let okay. me just um, let me just I roll did. my um, um, evade, um, Ooh, which, yeah. which I I fail. Um, yeah. yeah. Um, so um, yeah, I'm also going to do what I did last time, which is max damage in the face. Yeah. Okay. Then I'm going. She is going to have no teeth. Is this with the even, shotgun? <laughs> I could. No, you got your shield out. You would have to. I have a weapon. shield. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll do. I'll do the. I'll use the shield. Okay then. Um, <laughs> um let me do so a one d ten. Yeah, yeah. Fourteen again. Um, fourteen to my um head. Um, yeah. yeah. So that um takes her um neatly um out. Uh, you sort of like knock knock her out and she slumps to the floor and as she slumps to the floor and sort of like rocks back um, you notice that her eyes change to these crystal blue eyes that are looking at you almost like um, mournfully um, as if perhaps you've freed her um, from Ooh. something and we're coming back up to the top of the turn it, or can, because these are small i was wondering one thing um what small can i roll it can i roll the the, the blimkins or whatever the bankins yeah bankins yeah could i roll an intimidation skill check on them um for yeah. just whacking out like you know in two heads took out two people very aggressively yeah, so if you want to use a skill, it would take you an action point, so you could do it on yeah. turn um, three okay. if if you um, wish. Um, Rabbit, we're up to you first, though. I don't have any action points, but could I buy one with a luck point? Uh, by all means. Because um, I attacked, then defended, then attacked. Of course, yeah. Um, so I'm going to use this to spin around and smack down this Bainkin. Okay. Go for it. Take a stun to the face. 82 of 87. Yeah, that hits. I've got no Very action nice. points left. Yeah. Um, oh, yeah, I should roll. Hit location. 20. It will be a 10. And as I said, I would like a stun. I guess I did that in the wrong order again. Um, they do some damage. Some damage. Wow, six damage. Um, yeah, um, one, f- um, one, five. Um, yeah. So where was it in the ten, which is right in its um chest? Um, so this <laughs> nice solid hit. In the nice of it. solid hit, either with the end of your staff or swiping it straight um across. Which would you prefer? The second one. I'm like swinging it like a bat. Um, yeah. Just trying to just thwap it and leave a stinging mark. And you sort of like slap it into the wall and the banking has taken enough hits now for it to be out um, of it. Um, this other banking, however, is not giving up um, on the beloved banner and comes uh, in again, but misses. Um, um, Underlin nice. is um, out of it. Um, Sophia, Misty, uh, what mm. would you like to do? Very I'm nice. going to throw a water blast myself at this thing here. Yeah, squirt them out. Nice. Um, here we go. It's going to be a big 
thick water blast. Oh, hang on. <laughs> Let me get your effect out because you've you've got an effect uh, before this. Oh, I do. Like. <laughs> like that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, uh, so yeah, that's a hit. Yeah, I'm not going to do the standard thing, so that's fine. Um, right, so roll a location. It's a twelve. Uh, yes, that is one of its wings. Um, it's going to be stunned again. Yeah, because it's, because it's a thicker jet. This one. Right here we go. Ooh. Um, I think I get. Is it stun location that I'm doing? Yes, yeah. Yeah, I think I get uh, an endurance. Um, oh, nice. Oh, yeah. Um, but even with that, you knock it. Um... No, sorry, it's not. <laughs> it's not... <laughs> Firing back. <laughs> this, 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 this isn't a peeing contest. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's sort of like wax. Um, into it but it's it's even with its um dodge it's the stun is big enough to knock it back um your water elemental by the way will fire at the bank in in front of um rabbit again won't it because it carries mm -hmm. on its order so you That's right. you whack it uh rabbit you bring your it's all like wax up against the wall you bring your staff a while and then um the tornado goes Psh! And so, like, hits it again uh, against the wall, and it's just sort of like, do you want to tick it well with your, um, mm. with your little tornado? Seven hit rabbit. Oh, oh, That's a miss. yeah, it's a, it's fine. It, the banking's out, so it's purely for um, effect. Mm. Um, so I need to take that out, and um, banner, you're up. All right. Um, Banner's gonna move forward and see if, uh, with his shield out, ready to kick some more butt. So he's gonna run this and in, do this way. Okay. Show me where you would like to end up. Um, probably here. Okay. So just let me. Show move one. Thing on okay so as you go in mm -hmm. you can see um somebody um, oh, damn these are pillars you can see the four um pillars there's some steps going down into the water she's um stood in the water and she's holding up the um, tablet, and it looks like the people in the corridor has done their thing because in the time that it's taken you to take them out, you can see that there's a huge black void. Um, Where? It, it's sort of like it is. I'll, I'll mark it on for you so you can um, see it. Um, he, there. Sorry, that came onto the wrong layer. My, my fault. Can you see that? Yeah. Uh, let me just get rid of my other one because I can see it on my screen. Um. Yeah, and it appears that the um, the chanting. You figured the one that you've just knocked out was um engage with this but you can see that this huge black swirling void is there and as she sort of like continues her her chanting holding up the tablet you know that there's tendrils of blackness um coming out from her and you also notice that every now and again the the purple bits looks like a bit of plastic or cellophane because <clears throat> every now and again, 
uh, a sort of like a demon head sort of like pushes itself above against it and you sort of mm. like see the outline of the face and then um, all of a sudden a claw hand um, comes out and it looks like there's things trying to push um, the way and through. penetrate the veil Ugh. yeah it, exactly yeah. and it that's cool it looks so close to being um completed as we go into um round three um and i i'll take it um banner you probably sort of like exclaim etc so people um you will know that there's something going on in there um rabbit you're first um i guess i would um sprint on over into the room preparing to hit something okay probably like run out to here yeah um And the this chanting person's in the water. Yes. Right? Her feet are in the water, and that's where the black um, tendrils are coming up from, very much like the tendrils um, that got the dog and banner and everything like that. You do think that it seems to be a huge amount of delaying tactics um, in the corridor, so but you don't know what these tendrils will do that's around her at all. Um, okay, well, I know exactly what I would do here, and it's the opposite of what Rabbit would do. She is going to use her speed charge ability to try and go in so fast that she can hit this this person and then launch over onto the, the non-watered areas, hopefully. Right. Um, that's her attempt, so I'm going to take down two points. Okay. Here's where she dies. And going in for a swing at this person. Uh, Fast and Furious. 36. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Let's bring up Monsieur Eclipse. Uh, let me just pop it out so it's not on uh, the this screen. Wait, it's just loading um, up. Da, 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 um. What did you get, sorry? 30... 36. 36. Okay. Um, yeah. So um you um come in and you swipe um at this um person. And as you swipe, you just your your um your staff seems to almost like just go through her as if she's some kind of um, projection or some kind um, of ghost as it sort of like swings um, through her. Um, you said you wanted to do something else, I think. Yeah, I was hoping that with my speed charge and 48 movement, I'd be able to like attack and like end up over here somewhere. Yeah, so you'll be able to do um third of your running attack um if you've done uh, an action as well. So you can Okay, uh, so I should I should be able to make it at least yeah. like right here. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Um that would be my turn. Okay then. Um and it, it's this person's um turn now and you you notice rabbit and banner from where you are you sudden well banner you probably don't think about this um you think rabbit that it could be that she's concentrating on something else rather than um the portal um being um open um but she um spends her action um still muttering uh, under her breath um with the um portal um open still i just need to add something to her sheet now okay then um misty you're up right i am right oh, that sounded right. so <laughs> One, two, <laughs> three, four five that was uh that does it's like right 
One, right. two, three. <laughs> um, so she stood the tablet above her head. She's got the tablets above her head. Yeah, she's holding them. Oh, I see what you're going to try to do now. Yeah. You're going to try to knock um, them out of her hand. Yeah. Oh. Um, you probably heard well, Rabbit shall like shout over the communications. My stuff went straight through her. My stuff went straight through her. No, She's I cheating. Think, uh, That's uh, not how it's supposed to work. I think Misty or, or, or Sophie would know that she needs to break a concentration just like they would need to break my Could be, yeah. Yeah. You, you know. So I'm, I'm going to hit the one thing that she needs to make this ritual work. Nice. Um, right, yeah. I think I've justified the hell out of that. All right, there we go. <laughs> I would have said yes at the beginning, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it doesn't matter anyway. Um, do you know what? <laughs> I, I, I'm going to take the fumble because I've walked into the room and this has been like instant sort of, oh, oh, fire. Uh, so and you go, I, I will... whoa, and yeah. the, the, <laughs> the blast hits rabbit. I was going to say, how much damage does rabbit need? <laughs> so, yeah, as, as I'm doing this, I, I step in there and, and I send a jet of water, but I'm more startled by the portal that I can just see behind the tablets. Yeah. And so my aim goes slightly off into the portal. Okay, yeah, and you sort of go psh, uh, oh, yeah. into it. And what you notice is that, and rather worryingly, it goes through it. Oh. It looks like things are coming. Um, it's weakening by the um, turn. Um, mm. Your tornado has a no Oh, do you need to no, no, no. I, I need to give it. I need to use an action to tell it what to do. Um, so it's, it's going to stay there. Yeah, so it just hits the banking again. Mm -hmm. It goes, yep. it's, just, it's just doing a wee but, on but, the yeah, bank. It's a sort of bank and it, it's punched it with water. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, Banner, you're up. Um, Banner's going to run up, right up here to get a little closer. Uh, question, is there like a tablet in this person's hand or something? Yeah, the four tablets are both That's what I joined together on it. Like, I'm going to throw my shield at the Ooh. tablet. like an Oreo. Uh, yeah. yeah. I thought you were going to unsheath your shotgun and just blast That's it. That's coming soon. I, just... I, I prefer the shield. I, yeah. yeah. Chuck it. Chuck in the shield. Uh, specifically, hopefully, at, those, at that instead. Come on, baby. Uh, yeah. uh, 20, uh, 21. Um does what's, it what's what's the tablets evade? Yeah, does it um, come back to you, your shield? Yeah, uh, I have to use a PowerPoint, but yeah. All right. So it sort of like goes. For, are you going to use a PowerPoint to bring it back? Yeah, I use PowerPoint. Yeah. yeah. So you chuck it um, out. Okay, then. Um, so the twenty-one um, probably hits. That's not uh, an issue. Um, I am going to make her roll an athletics check to see whether or not she drops it against your initial roll, which is 21. Mm. Uh, so this is her uh, dyslexic... Dyslexic... <laughs> I said a dyslexic check. This her, her athletics check, uh, dyslexic which check. which she um, doesn't make. Um, is, so, is that, is that a, um, a critical fail? Um, no. No, okay. Uh, 99 and 100. Yeah, um, yeah, it's yeah. always wait, 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 wait. I have an ability I think I can use here. No, I can't. Never mind. <laughs> no, I, well, it's because my bad penny. I could, I can force you to make your rolls a level more difficult, and then I realize it's as long as they're within my eyesight. Yeah, I'm guessing I'm just turning around now. So I. Yeah, exactly. I'm sorry. sorry to interrupt. Yeah, so the shield goes rushing off, and it hits this. Her hand, and she she feels it being whacked uh, out of her hand. Um, can you do some um, damage for me, please, Banner? Oh yeah, I will definitely do some damage. Um, where are you? Where's the damage thing? This. 
Yeah, so it hits into the um, tablet and she she leaves. It gets sort of like wrenched out of her hand as the shield goes across it and it hits it. And it sort of like comes flying out um, by you, um, um, Rabbit. And sh she sort of like feels it going away. And you notice that the portal contracts um, slightly. And she sort of, you see her turning and you notice that her her body seems to solidify um, more and it looks like she might have had some kind of power to make her ghostly uh, mm -hmm. and it goes and it just wax on um on the floor and it's broken up into cool. its four pieces and yes. banner you use your powerpoint and your shield um comes um to you um, nice. and we come up to turn two rabbit you're up um rabbit would be turning and um going right back for it actually <laughs> I, I mean she hasn't seen this tablet stuff she's not thinking she's just trying to to kill and so she's probably guessing it's a it's like you can't keep this up forever. I'm faster than you. I could be faster than your projection. Yeah, here. And, and as you sort of like whirl round, going at your full speed, coming in, you suddenly see Banner's shield whack it off and it sort of like flies off in what appears to you to be slow motion as you come in for your next attack. Yeah. Um, And this is a regular attack. I want to be engaged at the end of the round. Um, okay, then, yeah. And pa-pow! Why am I getting so many thirties? I mean, you can re-roll it if you wish. No, and... I don't want to re-roll. It. I keep getting like thirty-two and thirty-six. I feel um, this is um, her um, evade here. Oh, um, this is where I'd like to use Bad Penny. Um, yeah, to yeah. give you one of my luck points to make that um, from a success to a fail. Yeah, so 46. Yeah, because she if she had evaded that, she would have taken no damage from you um at all. So it fails um at um hard, which means that you get the uh, attack so you'll get um hit location and um sorry, special hit location and damage. So up up close I do see these tablets though that, that that's the only thing they're wielding as a weapon the tablet has been whacked out of her hand oh, that's right and it's sort of yeah. like down here you okay, can try then. to grab it that's I'm too quick to think of that um okay. no I'm, I'm going for the the strike here um yeah. I'm, I'm going to try and do a stun and here's a d20 you're seven and um, seven is right in a gut yeah, I'm gonna smack her gut or go right through four, five uh, or zero damage. Five points. No, um, that actually, um, she's only got one point, um, of armor, which goes that takes it down to, um, four here. Yeah, yeah. take a stun to the tummy. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> okay, then, um, blow to the torso causes the defender to stagger, winded, and only able to defend. So she is on a defensive mode. Oh, hang on a minute. Up your banner. Hang on, hang on. I have an endurance check, don't I? That's right, okay. against my 32. Uh, yeah, okay, then. Maybe I'm not setting you up. Um, she, she, no, she, she, she fails it. Um, so she's sort of like, you whack her in the chest. <coughs> you know, like, <laughs> like, like that. And she's sort of like... Um, goes down she can only defend um ooh. would you class defending using a defensive power nope. i mean yeah like my enhanced reactions is like a defensive power i guess as long as the defensive power is just creating a spotlight where i can punch her right in the face <laughs> her defensive power is probably um, Scorch Earth. Suicide yeah. bomb? Yeah. I, 
I, I think I'm, and I'm quite happy for you to use it as well. Um, but it's her turn. But, but, but we don't have it. Um, well, you, you'll you'll see you'll see what I I mean. Um, so she uses a power on her eighteen and does a night night crawler trick. Oh, lovely! And she goes, yeah, yeah like no, she, can she she can definitely do that. And she, she appears, so she almost like teleports. And it's almost like a shadow step, and you just see like black cloud rope appear around and go psh, like that. She disappears, and there's this a mist of blackness, and then she reappears um, down um, the corridor. She's bent over, and is just sort of like um, trying to walk now um, out of it. Um, Misty, you're up. Yep, I totally agree, and that was a brilliant move. So what I'm going to do. <laughs> Is something very similar. I, ooh. Yeah, I, I, I'm going to go from here and move to behind her and whisper in her, I can do that too. <laughs> but, but I can't, so I'm not going <laughs> to. I was thinking, wow, I didn't mean she had yeah. <laughs> Fantastic. Um, um, right, I, I am, I'm going to use my first action to tell my whirlpool whirlwind uh to um attack her yeah but then in my second action is going to uh fire a a blast again this blast you'll notice is very thin and it's going to be an armor piercing blast of water hang on how say say that again did you say like you had two oh, actions i've got two actions the first one's going to command the simulacrum to attack her and the second one so, is to do a water blast. I'm not moving or anything. Um, oh, no. What am I talking about? <laughs> no, ignore that. <laughs> I can't do two actions at the same time. I'm thinking the D &D Yeah, you, you were thinking that. Yeah. It was still round the other way. I'm just going to shoot her, sorry. <laughs> um, I'll, 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 I'll do the water elemental. <laughs> the water element still. Oh! I'm going to use a point of luck after that. Or, or use a that. hero point to make it automatically hit. Oh, I can't Ooh. do that. Um, Square in the back. <laughs> well, no, it'd be, it'd be through the head, wouldn't it? Or, or through the... I tell you what, I, I'm changing my yeah. mind about hero points. I think with a hero point, you automatically do a critical hit. Yeah. That sounds better, doesn't it? Because... It, no, I'm, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to... We'll do I'm that from now on. I like the yeah. idea of that, yeah. I'll, I'll use a point of look to reverse the roll. Um, so 20, 26. 59. Uh, no, 59. Oh, 59. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, 59 yeah, yeah. Um, will hit. I I don't know this is coming, so I'm not reacting to it. So hit, um, special hit location so and damage. I need, I need to spend a point of... Thing to do for all oh, you're doing, doing armor piercing. I'm doing armor piercing, nice. Um, which for some reason is not on there. But so bear with me. I'm here. We go. One I do like the look of these armor. new cards that right. on the sheet, they look really nice. Yeah, so that's eight points, and that will bypass your armor. Or does it all no, your, your location? Sorry, your location. Yeah. My apologies. Ouch. Uh, yeah, it's automatically. Uh, where are we? Uh, oh, piercing. So if that. Let me, let me just do that. Uh, oh, sorry. For every point reduces it. So it's one point to spend. So you only get one point of armor. So it'll yeah. go through. Okay, then. Um, so where was it going? 17. 17. Which is her arm. And how much damage? Eight. Uh, eight. Yeah. Um so that takes her down to um she needs to make an endurance roll against your original attack, which was uh, 59. 59. Okay. Uh she fails and you sort of like whack this into her back, and as she's staggering away, it goes bang like that, and she just topples down head first. Um, into the um, into the water. She's um, 
practically now um, stunned and incapacitated. Um, as soon as the tablets were broken, by the way, this portal slowly um, diminishes and then at the last moment pops out of um, existence. Um, there are four tablet bits on the floor. I imagine Banner probably goes up and... That's what I was thinking. Maybe I should... I'm going to gently pick him up and then, like, you know, roll my... Uh... Shotgun. Uh, bra <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm gonna I'm gonna roll my uh my what, what do you call it? My brawn, but I'm probably gonna fail. No, you what you should do is pick her up and try to dance with her. Because <laughs> oh, you, yes. yet you're likely to fail at your dance roll. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh <just> snap. <laughs> But, Try and conceal it. Try and conceal it. Yeah. If you get a crit, you're not really stupid. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so um, this, um, just so you know, you probably saw her name, but she's called Eclipse. Mm -hmm. uh, Was called name. Eclipse. Say again, sorry. Def def Was, definitely yeah. sounds like a hippie. Uh, I said Was called Eclipse. Okay, get that. She, Was. Her new yeah. name is called Inmate. <laughs> so I will add. So there's... A few things that we need to decide what to do before we leave this. Um, first thing, I'm assuming that you're handing Eclipse over to the police force. Yeah. What's left of her, yes. Yeah. Okay, then. And do remember that you did hand something, uh, somebody over to the police force and they escaped. Mm, uh, yeah. That's true. Um, so, uh, what we'll say is, so the police when we hand her over is keep her blindfolded. If she doesn't know where she is, she can't teleport anywhere. Yeah, of and probably comatose as well. Mm. You know, so yeah. and we don't want we, to, we need a better jail system. We, or we don't want to, to become yeah. intangible and you know, float down three yeah. things. So anyway, yeah. Okay, then so she can be handed over to the police. Um, but the better question is what are you going to do with the four pieces of tablet? We're going to make a three. Yeah. Are you going to? Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm going to give them to Ethan or give no, one of them to Ethan. We get, we'll get, we'll like maybe one of them, but I feel like I need to smash one of them. We can't, we can't have four. Yeah. There needs, yeah. There needs to be one missing at least. Yeah. Let's maybe um, do the one that, uh, that belonged to the, uh, very wealthy guy. So is the idea you that you're going to I'll tell you what do. smash no, there was, smash three of them us. and give one back to Ethan? Why don't we ring up, get a call, <laughs> him and say, what should we do with these tablets? He says, give them to me, we'll smash them up. Well, he said for us to break them. We already had that conversation oh, did, on the oh, phone. Oh, he did, didn't he? Sorry, yes. Um, but, but I feel like when we go to turn in Eclipse, we need to have a reason why we're turning them in mm. and saying they were in the sewer and we beat the, the tar out of them is not very much like a good no. argument. I'm guessing the Bankins have already done what they did last time and turned to dust. So that's not really evidence we have either. This is okay. just, we beat up a lady and then we're bringing her to the police station. Doesn't make much sense. So we got to bring like the two pieces of the, 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 circular and what, what the, the tablet about, there's yeah. the word we gotta bring those pieces back to the two museums that are stolen from to say mm -hmm. we found the museum thief this is the person who is breaking Got, in yeah yeah we caught her we didn't just beat up a random woman in the store <laughs> mm. nice yes nice banner um so that's <laughs> that's a good story that i like that that's a good cover story so but you will have two more pieces once... Those we break. We're going to break them, smash them to little pieces. Okay, then. smash them to crumble, and then I'll, I'll put them in my protein and shake then, and drink them. Uh, and then take that's... take the crumbs and take them to a builder's yard who has like um, a aggregate, uh, you know, all the all um, <laughs> rubble and stuff, <laughs> and, and mix, it everywhere. And mix them yeah, in. Mix so, yeah. um, so because you know there will be somebody out there who will spend time and put them back together. They would yeah. do in my campaign at all, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, so you, you smash two of them and you take um, Eclipse back. The, the cops are really pleased that you, and so are the museums, and that you managed to apprehend this nasty woman who's been stealing things um, left, right, and um, center. They, they do... Um, 
sort of like they're pleased to receive the um, tablets back. And Ethan is very pleased about it, Rabbit. And so sort of like you see him smile, um, but you're not too. Just roll your insight, Rabbit. Yeah, he's kind of hard to understand sometimes. Uh... <laughs> um, can I use a point of luck to reroll that? Uh, yeah, by all means. Okay, I'll, I'll only have one left. Um... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he seems to give a smile, but you're not too sure um, what he's what the... smiling. Maybe he's just, like hitting on you. Maybe, uh, maybe that's what it is. Uh, there's there's one Ethan. thing that I would like you all to do, and just to let you know. The skill check for this is Herculean, okay? Um, but um, I would like you to make each of you a roll. And if anybody gets it as a Herculean, then I'll give you an extra piece of information. Uh, if nobody gets it, you get what nothing. Role? What uh, role specifically? Well, I, I was going to... Uh, I think I'll say willpower. No, actually, I won't, because... Misty probably got very excited when I said willpower. <laughs> <laughs> but no, oh, yeah. it's not a willpower check. It's a perception check. Uh, oh, perception. Worse. Yeah, no. no chance. Herculean. I have one luck point left. Uh, is, is that, uh, you got it. Oh, oh so close. Yeah. I, I have a luck point, though. I'm going to spend my luck point. Or, my last luck point. or a hero oh. point. I, I don't... Do I have? The party has two, I think, Medivac. Is that right? It, it might be even three. I don't know. We've not used them for ages. Yeah. yeah. You, you might as well use it. I, I'll we've, get not used, use it. we've not used any during this campaign. Well, yeah. uh, then, it's, the last, it's the last roll of the campaign. Maybe Sophia should be the one to use no, it. No, no, though, no, 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 no. You do it. You do it, Robert. You best do it because Banner will understand. Well, if you use a hero <laughs> point... Um, Rabbit, you won't need to roll. It'll be an automatic success for you. Uh, yeah. I guess I was just saying, Sophia is like the, the smart one of the group. No, if but you're, you're, could... you're the eyes on the ground. You spot things that other people don't see. Okay, okay. Uh, then I will use, use the hero point, point that's been given to me. Okay. Um, so it's something that you um, notice as you're handing over the tablet to um, Ethan. and you're not too sure what made you consider it. Maybe some kind of slight difference in the tablet, a change of color, change of marking, but you're not too sure, but it almost looked more like a copy than the original. Not too sure how, but you certainly get that feeling that it could be a copy of the original rather than the original. Oh, never left yeah. hands. Well, well, she has the power to teleport and stuff. Or, or this is just a copy. And there are real ones out there, and maybe why somebody's spell was having a hard time going off was they're using poorly recreated magical items. Dun, dun, By the dun. way, the the um, gala is a great success. Um, you weren't underneath it, but Medivac, I wish <laughs> I'd thought about that. I really would have <laughs> have <laughs> done that. <laughs> <laughs> That, but I've st I've written it down um, for later on. You, for, the, for the next gala. Yeah, um, <laughs> you 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 had four hero points. You've now got three hero points. Um, oh, two yay. from last month and two from this month. Um, so that's you down to Banner three. is just like excited that he was right. They were actually witches. Oh yes, yeah, witches. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, um, yeah. You do because we've had four um, sessions. It does mean that you'll get eight um experience points um nice. one uh experience roll sorry um two per um session and each session has been quite involved um even the first one so it's not as if um you want to get one for that but you so you get eight experience rolls so when we come back 
to destined, then you can roll them then and decide um, how are you going to use them. Um, more importantly, tomorrow, next Saturday, if everyone's available, we will be blasting off into space because we are moving across to M space, which is a science fiction role playing game. And the characters have Minsk, who's like the face and the pilot and driver. Hammond, who's like a handyman, of job man. And um, <laughs> Newman, who is a ex-law enforcer. And we'll have Tickety Tex with us playing his um, psionic character. Um, just to let you know, Purdy will still be there, but she won't have a a screen slot, if that makes sense. Yeah. Um, but she'll still be there. And if anybody ever joins the group and wants to play the medic, then what I'm going to do is put um, Purdy in a ship. So can you remember, please state the nature of your medical emergency, almost mm. like somebody in a ship. Um, Darth says, um, M space hype <clears throat> and then says, can't wait for Newman to lay down the law again. <laughs> yeah, that's what he does. Uh, with his, <laughs> so I, I think, I think Banner is actually very jealous of Newman and that's why he's got the shotgun. You know? It's okay. I, I'm jealous. Oh, too yeah. Of him, so. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, so we'll move straight on. We've had some weeks that we haven't had sessions. So I've managed to start creating the adventure. I've just got to put the finishing touches to it for the first um, session. But yeah, do come back and watch. And then after... Uh, myth uh, after M space we'll be moving to Mithras for a couple of uh, ventures and then after that we'll be going on to a new investigative um, game and we'll start that off by making characters all together and seeing what happens there um, players uh, Mr Pickles do you want to advertise your podcast Yes, I have a podcast. It is called, and I took that personally. You can find it on Apple and Spotify podcasts. It's myself and my friend Brad talking about movies. And the last movie we talked about was Wizards from 1977. You want to see, or well, if you want to hear us talk about an atrociously bad movie with terrible animation and prolific Nazi imagery in what you would think is an animated like family fantasy movie, that's the last one we talked about. Fantastic. Are you allowed to talk about Disney films like that? It's, oh it's it's something <laughs> and just so you know the um the link to that is in the chat um uh, medivac oh uh, yes thanks i'm playing or oh, we're, we're streaming um court well trailer cthulhu on monday night at quarter past seven and on thursdays at a new time of half past seven we are doing warhammer fancy role play um as we are now guards in the city watch oh yes is, yes yeah. And, and there's a troll out there. And, it's and dragging you dragging people into the river. And you play um, a postman. Uh, a postman, <laughs> yes, in the watch. Um, uh, Captain. Does it know? We'll know. <laughs> <laughs> Captain, do you have anything um, that you would like to? <laughs> I'm I'm gonna be I'm gonna be live streaming my nap. I'm gonna have right after this. Um, uh, I'll have a few different angles, which are lines good, so you guys can watch me uh, sleep and snore horrendously. Brilliant. Um, and if you yeah. would like to see, um, Captain dressed up as Shrek and at uh -huh. his next his next rave, um, then I'm sure there'll be pictures available across the internet. Um, to there watch there might him. be out there, yeah. Yeah, so brilliant. Okay, well done, everyone. I hope you um, enjoyed it. Everybody, including the players, hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Um, really like these combats that could be very narrative and really show you off to be heroes. Remember, that's not how we play M Space. So be, be prepared. But if you remember, mm. you are currently on a ship and the ship has just gone to a new um, quadrant, a new solar system where you've, you're dropping off or you've just landed um, the son of the Black Star with the young girl that appeared to be some kind of icon or savior to the son of Black Star. And that's where we left it. If you remember, you 
drove after another ship and shot it down. And and mm. there was um, you got boarded. Uh, yeah. If, right. Yeah. <laughs> And those those guys were jerks the uh, entire time. Uh, we let yeah. them live, and they came back and uh, so rude. That's so it. And, and I do believe Minsk mm. has a a change <laughs> on his face. I do have a broken <laughs> face because they stumped on it, and they're going to pay for that. They're going to die horribly, which is never <laughs> good for the face character. Isn't it? <laughs> no, no. I'm, I'm I'm hoping that Purdy is is very good at putting it back to how it was. Uh, I'm sure she will be, or maybe even slip a cybernetic eye in there. Oh, Steve yeah. Austin, a man barely yeah, alive. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh. Okay, so we're going to head off now. Let Captain Kangaroo get some sleep from after his Shrek rave. Thank you very much for coming along tonight. Thank you also for um, <laughs> the donation um, from um, ba, 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 uh, they. Um, I can't find. Oh, there's um, the thy royal fleeks. Thank you very much for that. That's very um, appreciative. And yeah, Darv says thanks for the adventure and everything. So yeah, um, have a, a good evening, day, or afternoon, and we'll see you all next time. So yeah, have fun. Bye. Say goodbye. Say goodbye. Bye, bye. bye guys. <laughs> bye, guys. Bye. Oh, this, I can.